All done. Would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. little brother.
Okay. I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Dean hasn't given up on excavation by explosions. That can't be happening. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Let's see here. You see something? Thanks for waiting. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. Rape's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. He's thinking the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam. If you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. Well, you know, besides books, Push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs. It's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Whoa! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Okay, shall we pick up where we left off? Um, no. Oh, right. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like he could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? 
I got my money and got the hell out of there. Check it out, boys. What is it? probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. <clears throat> hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? <clears throat> Can't tell. <clears throat> I'll let you look at this. Quite the view. <sighs> just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. No, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. You bet. we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Hey, what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? Maybe. Up. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. <laughs> 